Welcome back to another video with Pisces Illustrations. My name is Amanda Alexis. And yeah, I was supposed to do Inktober this year. And I did. I started off doing Inktober this year, but I, um, um, well, if you can see from this footage, I didn't quite finish. I got to like, what, day six? And yeah, it was a struggle. Um, so what happened? Life. So, Music instead, what I'm going to do for you guys is um, show you a um, zombie. A zombie? Yeah. <laughs> I'm creating a zombie today. And, uh, yeah, just stick around and watch me create this art. As you guys can see, I'm starting off with the sketch of the zombie. And um, I didn't just necessarily come up with this idea at the top of my head. I actually had like um, a photo reference, as you can see right here on the right side of the screen. Um, I'm basing this zombie off of this uh, creepy zombie um, character that somebody else created, well, took a picture of. And, and uh, I just thought it was pretty cool and I wanted to use it and kind of put my own spin on it. I really enjoy the, just like all the lines, the wrinkles in his face, just it's so much detail. I am so detailed. And we're on to the inking process. Yeah, um, I was out of frame. I didn't realize it. But, uh, yeah, I'll be coming back into frame pretty soon. If you wanna touch my please use caution. Beg, please get on your knees. Came from the jungle, up in the trees. I got a few tricks up in the sleeve. One wrong move, I'ma let out the let out the let out the big shoes, check out the crease. Go like I'm big foot, step on the beat. Make a man's run so here I am inking with one of my um Japanese um my crumpets. I really like Japanese like stationary pins and markers. It's just I don't know. They're they're a lot cooler than um, other products out there on the market, I, I must say. Stop that. Yeah, and, and as you can see, I am I am uh, uh, putting like stickers and putting a, um, what, what kind of t-shirt? I call it a vacation t-shirt? I don't know. Uh, on the zombie, I'm kind of trying to make it my own, you know? Shot with the prize, let the devil tell me I'm awesome, yeah. Act like fire on the pine. If you wanna touch my please use caution. And I have been taking this forever now. Uh, let's kind of uh, speed this process up with a little magic. Here we go. Bam. Now that the inking is done, oh my gosh, I just love all the details in this. I'm gonna take a picture and I have another video that I'll be posting soon of me uh, creating this digitally and creating stickers and prints to put on my shop. On to the coloring process. Um, I was a little uh, confused as to like what colors I was going to use for the zombie. So uh, ultimately, I decided to go with like uh, a yellow undertone or a base color. Use the yellow for the, uh, the the base color, and then go on top of it with green. I know this is probably not so original, but hey, it works for this. So. Spend it in a day, I don't do no saving. Use the make place, trapping out the days in. I was big time, big time. I was I O. Damage in my teeth, I got a lot of shine. Running up the numbers, that's a lot of grind. Yo, try and take. 
take it from me must be out your mind yeah oh, i'm big time i'm really liking how this is uh turning out so far um in the future i plan on creating more with uh color pencils i used to well i didn't use color pencils a lot back in the day but i kind of want to get back into using them you know? i mean i use them more than i use them now but like i really want to get good at um color pencils and water color Artlist I And if you guys have watched this far into the video, go ahead and leave me a like and uh, a comment down below. Tell me what is your favorite, um, I guess, creature on Halloween. If you like Halloween or if you celebrate Halloween or care anything about Halloween, do you like? Uh, you know, zombies, monsters, vampires. If so, just you know, kind of let me know. What's your favorite? Here's a close up of me coloring his shirt pink. Like, I think this is a very good um, color combination yellow, green, and pink. They work so well together. <laughs> And also, uh, I plan on dropping another uh, video of me creating a, a Halloween monster. Listen, I know these are kind of past due. It is November now, but you know, I started these projects in October. And I uh, really couldn't finish them in the time frame that I wanted to, but you know, it's all good. They're coming anyway. Music licensing reimagined. I think next year for Inktober, what I'm going to do is so <laughs> so that I don't run out of time or I don't feel like I'm rushing and you know so I can complete the challenge. Uh, I'm going to not put them in a sketchbook because it's almost like wasting a sketchbook because it's like okay, I, I've done Inktober in the sketchbook. But you know, I didn't fill the sketchbook full of Inktober drawings. But the cover says, you know, let's say it says Inktober 2020 or Inktober 2019. But you know, it's not going to fill the entire sketchbook up. Not the ones that I buy. We imagined. Um, so I'll just be using like little cardstock or something of that nature. I need to plan uh, my sketches out at least a month or two in advance as well and yeah so I will be participating in October 2021 for sure oh and also I will be participating in Mermaids as well so be on the lookout for those videos and um, the tips that I just mentioned I'm going to actually apply them to uh, Mermaid as well Music licensing reimagined. Golden and draw with, with waffles. <laughs> uh, I saw videos of them creating characters out of candy. I was like, oh, I was going to do that. I mean, I still am. And um, I think, you know, Casey's kind of licensing. Do we imagine? Anyway. She has her um, the Tokyo treats. Tokyo box. Tokyo treats. Those are very, like, the that, that subscription. Uh, it's pretty good by the way. I had a couple uh, boxes myself and they were tasty and you know unique treats. And I'm still thinking about uh, creating characters out of candy. Well, Halloween candy. 
I, I'm still thinking about that. I still think I will do that, but of course it's gonna drop in November. <laughs> and I, I might do that I for own. Christmas as well. So stay tuned for that. Decided to go with orange because blue and orange are complementary colors. Music Just licensing, like green and and um, what green and red are complementary colors. But instead of using red, uh, I used pink for like the sticker and the shirt. To me, these colors work well together. Music licensing reimagined. Music licensing reimagined. Oh. 